All right, and we're back. And today we're coming to you live from Titusville Courtyard by Marriott. We're up here at the Space Bar. That's our view, guys. Look who I found. Quick question. Russ. We try. We try to know. We try to know. Which way am I looking? I'm, we're showing so, our kids. So yeah, and I'm like, you're looking right towards the vehicle assembly building, that big building, yeah. and then to the right. That's to the right. right. Oh, so that's it. I thought it was to the left. See those things on the left. So I'm really it's, glad that I asked. It should be to the right. So the white building and go to the right. Yeah. And it's that thing. You, you'll see it when it goes up. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, I could, I couldn't, I couldn't actually, I couldn't actually see it. I couldn't actually see it, yeah. see it. You, you actually see it. it. Um, with, even with the binoculars. It's out there. So it's like too white. Yeah, but it should be to the right of that. Yeah. All right, thank you. It's gonna be out there. The only thing that would be making better if we had like a shape. I know. These things should be so I, I claimed the spot hoping that maybe they would come up, but you know what, the, the sun is... Oh, yeah. No, it's right I mean, still gorgeous. Yeah. All right, well, we'll give you guys a look, a lay of the land here. Look at that. Awesome picture. You can come up and get a great pic by. Restaurant opens at 11 on weekends. There's no food right now, no beverage right now, but... Looks like the, uh, the first staff members here are getting it ready to go on the hold with you. She might extend the awnings. Come on, please do that. You can see ample viewing room. Uh, restaurant patrons and hotel guests get first priority. Um, on a day like today when it's not open, actually, they don't let anyone up, or at least in theory they're not. Um, on a day when the restaurant's open, they're going to charge you 10 bucks if you're not staying here to get up to the rooftop. Russ, how was your drive over this morning? Not bad. Not bad? No, no traffic. No traffic? That's no. amazing. Coming through Orlando, heck no. Sunday morning. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> what? <laughs> so nothing. Nothing. Really. Hey, good morning, Papa. Thanks for hopping on. You can see our view. I'll turn back around in a second. You can see the, uh, the rest of the facility. Look at that. There's Russ. Nice. Yeah. Is that kind of its first big road? Yeah, well, road, yeah, longest road trip I've taken in so far. Nice. Other than work. Nice. <laughs> yeah, I spent the good first half of our road trip trying. Oh, oh, first half of actually having the rental car and trying to figure That's out how to get that. in reverse. <laughs> that would be fun, right? As as we've determined with these new rental cars, they they've gone to this like single spinny dial or single like click it a few ways lever. Oh yeah. And. Uh, yeah, to get in reverse, you have to like hold a button down and, and sling it. I, uh, I'll tell you later about my rental car experience. That is still ongoing. Yeah? Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm not... Charge me about $300 extra. Oh, that's beautiful. Thanks, guys. Yeah, probably for some stupid reason. Oh, yeah. Yeah, love it. That's how you look up close. And I'm uh, in the process of fighting it, so... Yeah. 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 We're working it. Well, so they charged me like $230 extra. And then, you know, I, I appealed that because they... You guys know what time it launches? 1020. 1020. 1020, not yep. 1030. 1020. Over there? Yeah, it'll be right to the right of that big building. Where the towers are? Yes. Somewhat, they're really hazy right now, but it's to the right, and there's like, there's like little towers. That's yeah. where it's at. Oh, not the big towers over there. No, there's. Yeah, it's it's to the, it should be to the right of it. To the right there. Okay. Um, 
better. It's hard to see the tower. Are you, are you recording? No. Pull up your map and double check that. We told like two people. Well, I mean, I'm pretty sure that's what it is. But I mean, yeah, it's by the tower. I don't know, I mean, I don't know what, what uh, pad it's on, so. It's on uh, pad 40, and so 40 should be to the right. Man, that breeze is awesome. Oh, it's great. Oh, they charge charge me an upgrade fee because I had ordered an economy car. Yeah, and they didn't have an economy. They didn't have an economy car. No. no. Give me a Nissan Altima, yeah. and then charge me an extra two hundred. <laughs> yeah, no. And then. later I got another charge for another 60 bucks for no reason I don't even know what it's for <laughs> what's the last 60 bucks for you know that's, that's a thank you for bringing it back for us yeah. I left him a very scathing no. review no. called well I tried to call the store and what he answered talk, trying to get a hold of somebody yeah. um, when I was there at this, when I returned the car I asked him about it we'll, we'll go to Boca Boca to go to the store yeah. I'll get everything you know, set up here. Yeah. And I'll never, you know, I'll never hear from anybody. Oh, yeah, exactly. And then, uh, send an email to customer service. Uh, yeah, yeah. And I got a response saying that they're going to look into it, but I haven't started it. Just dispute it on the credit card and move on and fight. Well, that's what I'm going to do. Yep. That's what I always do. You know what? Usually when the money's involved, you'll find they get someone that... and try to understand what you're talking about. Yeah, I had that in California once. Oh, the toll roads. Okay, small. here's where I'm going. And there's to work on the toll road, right? And I'm going to find out exactly and where it's right. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That way. That was the only toll road that the cars don't work on. <laughs> so I got like a $125 bill in the bag. Well, see, I upgraded and got the, the Sun Pass. Yeah. For the week, the week and a half I had it, which was $11 an oh, yeah. hour a, a, a day. Yeah. Which is fine. Yeah. You know, $11 a day because I use it to, use it to, to from work. Yep. Know? Yep. So, I was willing to pay that, but yeah, not the $233 no. No. Upgrade, upgrade fee yeah. that I didn't deserve. No. I mean, that is why, like, what we do with National and, and Emerald Isle, because you get whatever car is there. Exactly. Yeah. Well, in every other rental car that I've ever gotten, yeah. they give you an upgrade if you don't. If they don't have if the they car, don't have it, they just give it to they you. Just give it to you. Yeah. Yeah. So that's what I assumed that it was. Yep. Because the guy told me, "Well, I'm gonna, you know, we're gonna upgrade you." Okay. Ooh, looks like Irene's on. Wow. Hey, hon. She's awake. Are you guys outside yet? I'm scared to tip the phone down. Upstairs. <laughs> Go upstairs. Wally is, uh, is sleeping out? still. Yeah, yeah, he's out. Yeah. Yep, that's what happens when we get in at 4 a.m. Yep. All right, well, we are here now about 15 minutes before launch, and you can see, you can see the crowd. To fill up. Yep, starting to fill up. They had extended the awnings. Russ and I might be in the shade right now. He's got a shade from a bar. Probably some licensing thing can't serve until. <laughs> yeah, hun, you should have made me put on sunscreen. Oh well, it'll be fine. Yeah. It's just my arms. We'll I've got my hat on. We'll yeah. I should still have sunscreen like leached into the skin from, from the weeks, <laughs> from the weeks that we were here. <laughs> There's an awesome, cool sea breeze this morning. I was kind of hoping my room would be ready soon because I would like to take a nap. So, I don't think it will be. I don't either. Because as we checked in last night, the entire hotel was out. Figured up because, because of this. the wedding. No, a wedding. Oh, a wedding? Yes. Get out. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So. Well, it's okay. 
you knew where the bathroom I'll hang out was? in the lobby or something. Perfect, buddy. We'll see. I might, I might be too jazzed up. Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. trying to find out where the, where the bathroom That or I might just go give me something to eat and yeah. relax, you know. Yeah. I almost just stopped. Yeah. I almost stopped at Wendy's and got breakfast. Yeah. I was like, no, I want to get in here. Yeah, get in your hangout. Yeah, that There'll be time for Wendy's. Right up against yeah. The wall. I had Wendy's last night for dinner. Too. <laughs> Is there a Wendy's? Uh... Yeah, it's just just back the other way. Okay. Maybe five minutes from there. Okay. There's a Wendy's, a Burger King, and like a oh, nice. Popeyes, possibly. I can't remember. Well, by the point we were driving in last night, I was more focused on yeah. staying awake and yeah. staying on the road. <laughs> Not driving into the ocean. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Which the second half of the, the drive over was me trying to figure out how to get the cruise control to start. Oh, yeah. yeah. To get the cruise control to start, you got to activate all the sensors. There's a little button that has like the sensor lights on it, and that of course brings all sorts of fun. What do you in. Got? It is a Nissan Pathfinder. Oh, it's a Nissan. That's why. That is why. It is 100% yeah, why. The Ultima that I had was a 2022. Yeah. Probably had the same kind and of kabuki little all, shifter. Did, yeah. Well, that too. It was loose. Mine was loose. <laughs> Like you go like because I'm I guarantee somebody tried you know tried to, tried to yank, it. yank it and it like because I, I when I first got in the thing I went to do it and the thing lifted up off the post. I mean the leather was the only thing holding it on. Oh uh, <laughs> yeah. And I guarantee that's probably why they charged me. Yeah. Because they think I broke it. Yep. But it wouldn't even though I recorded it. Yeah. Yeah, with the gate agent or whoever didn't, didn't write it down. And oh, they wrote it down. That's oh, really? Pictures too. And showed it. They wrote it down and put it on the paper and all what? That, it's either that or they're charging me for uh, gas, but I filled it up. Yeah. You know? Yeah. But I got on there on the Google and uh, read all the reviews after the fact. And, uh, yeah, I should have Yeah. yeah, I mean, if it's the only one available. Yeah. And that's probably their MO. Oh, yeah. They're cheaper and yep. they're, they're off property, yep. so they're... Yep, so they're going to um, not have the car you booked and then just course, casually, you know, Of course, the other thing, too, I more. booked through Priceline. So uh, I sent Priceline a message also. Yep. So, yeah. Because they charge me the Priceline. And that's actually very clean that they did it that way. I don't know. And just to dispute that on that card, the price line's still good. They're happy. Yeah, exactly. I'm fine to pay pay for the price line thing. Yeah. I guess so, yeah. Thanks for everyone for hopping in. We're here probably about 10 minutes from launch, hopefully. I mean, we're not over the pads. We can't see what the pad's like. But, man, if you were launching right, right where we're at, you'd be able to go. find someone to load up the SpaceX stream. I mean, I could pull it up just to see what's going on. Yeah, it should be live. Notifications went out then. But I ignored it. Well, uh, <laughs> you have the wonderful live. Yeah. Not yet. Here we go. Oh, wait. Space X. Yeah, that's the one. Well, you can see, we'll do another look around here for anyone just joining in. So, up here at the space bar, we're now 10 minutes before launch. You can see getting a little busier. food area. Off to the side would be the non-patrons viewing area. The restaurant and bar was open. Great view. If you're staying here at the hotel, you can also get your way back here to the air deck chairs. Sit on a... Right, it says 9 minutes, 7 seconds. Ok. 
Okay, Russ has got the got the live stream going. All right. All right. Well, I'm gonna keep you guys placed here so that you can watch. Pretty soon here, I'll get my other camera loaded up. We're here at the space bar. Courtyard by Marriott in Titusville. Guests of the hotel, we got in at 4 a.m. from our flight. Oh, that's painful, guys. 4 a.m. Eastern time till 9 o'clock, get up. Yeah, it's workable. Hotel guests get free range on the rooftop patio. So here we are. Was not planning on this launch, but as you know, Starlink launches come up randomly. And this one was scheduled, and I looked at the uh, launch calendar, and I go, Oh, that's Sunday morning. Got a Sunday morning launch, followed by a mimosa at the space bar. That can't be beat. Yeah, no, Papa, no uh, breakfast beverages. They're not serving yet, at least I haven't seen. Some people carried in their own. You know what? She might be. They might be open making beverages, so. But we're in game time right now. Thanks, hon, that keeping us posted. Russ has loaded the uh, SpaceX stream, so we got we got that going for us. What are they saying about weather? So far, so good. Okay. Eight minutes, forty-eight seconds. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Russ, your prayers have been answered. Nice. The awning is being extended. Look at that. Uh, countdown, we should be at about six minutes. Yep. Not gonna help me, I'm out here in the blazing sun, but that's okay. Doing it for you guys, doing it for the flog. <laughs> it's a good thing that the shade is not a requirement of launch. Five minutes. Russ says we got T minus five minutes. Yes, I will get some video on the camera for the vlog as well. I'll actually get some right now. Shade extended. <laughs> Amazingly, I made out unscathed on that. Wow, that was luck. <laughs> All right, for the uh, live vlogs benefit, the uh, awning just closed and all the water that collected on top of it, the condensation, just came raining down on everyone around me. I made that unscathed. That's amazing. All 
right, commentary for the uh, vlog camera. Good morning, Fun Fiero. Thanks for hopping on. We're here at the Space Bar Courtyard by Marriott here in Titusville. Guys, look at that. Look at that awesome poster there in the back. You can see the Space Bar logo. There's the actual bar. You know me, my Instagram pseudonym is the Space Bar Man, the Flying Space Bar Man. And this is amazing. This is a space bar that is holding a space bar man right now. You cannot believe how much my mind is blowing. And there's our view. No helicopters. No wayward helicopters. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. <laughs> Thankfully, they tightened that down after yeah. that last car fuffle. Yeah. And wayward boats as well. No cruise ships take off. They should all be in port already. Yikes, people. You can see down here, guests of the hotel can also go out on the, uh, on the edge. You get a nice little Adirondack chair or hammock if you really want. The view from down there is obstructed by a lot of trees and foliage. Um, I wouldn't necessarily recommend it, but for your casual viewer, it's quite fun to be that down close to the water. We got a cool sea breeze this morning. Our room is actually right down there, the third third patio over. I'm not going to be able to see Irene as she comes way out to the edge. Three minutes. It is three minutes to launch. Are they saying anything about the weather, Russ? So far, so good. So far, so good. All right, Let's I'm going to get out here to me. I'm gonna get the camera position. We're gonna do a stop clip on that video. Okay. Yes, production crew downstairs. We are filming on the vlog camera as well. I see it says recording. And now I just leveled it, so we're in good shape. Okay. Stage one oxygen load complete. Excellent. Stage one locks load is finalized. The finished one will be about a minute and 20 seconds before the stage two finalizes. T minus two. Two minutes, people. Yeah, fun, Fiero. Smell that sea breeze. <laughs> it smells a lot like rotten eggs. Yeah, pretty much. I'm sure that's all the uh, algae and stuff being blown in our general direction. All right. Here we go. Hopefully the wind noise isn't bugging you guys too much. I've got the uh, phone turned around and out of the wind, so it shouldn't be too bad, but let me know. Just stay stupidly. All right, about a minute 20 then. Yep. And the live stream is usually about 30 seconds to late, maybe 20, yeah. I'm turning it off, I'm good. Yep. A little filming. All right, guys, here we go. I'll try to track with the vlog camera. I'll be tracking the other camera, and I'm going to be watching with my eyes. There's nothing that beats watching a rocket launch with your eyes. We should be to the right of the vehicle assembly building there. Yep, there it is. There it is. <laughs> All right, there it is, guys. Did you see that bright?
stage separation with it at about that height. stage two you can see it you can see it right there you can see that little streak of cloud all right that's stage two going off it has probably reached space now so the uh, carbon cloud that gets created from the uh, falcon engine cool. Hey Magic Wishing Star, thanks for hopping in. You guys will need to switch on over to the uh, SpaceX stream to see it the rest of the way. I don't have any uh, space telescopes here at the space bar. That was it. That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. And here it is up here at the uh, Space bar. Yeah, Andy and Liz have it right there. Smash that like button. Just a quick stream. This is not a return to launch site launch. They're heading out to an autonomous spaceport drone ship, so we don't get to see anything come back. If we did, the landing pads would be about right over here. Uh, we are about six miles away from the launch pad, so we're about six and a half miles away from what would be the landing pad. Again, if there's a return to launch site, you want to be at Jetty Park, uh, where you end up within a couple miles um, of the landing pad. So, that's it. Well, now, it might be time to hit up the space bar. Thank you guys all for joining new here make sure to hit that subscribe button bell icon we got some fun more fun more streams coming up this is a wonderful world of walter i love you guys just the way you are bye from the spaceport